up? It's Ethan Cote here, and I'm back on Team Sonic Racing with my boy, Samurai Black Zack. And I'm Samurai Black Zack here, back in the cut, in the second... Well, it's not second, but it's been a minute since we're on Team Sonic Racing. And I'm with my homeboy, the one, the only, Enten Cote. And we are here with, with honestly we just bullshit. <laughs> yeah, we I'm listening up. Uh and I'm beyond God is that I would love to say that oh you guys are gonna have to edge out the curse words, da, 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 da. Once again, this PG era lifestyle that we gotta go through. Oh it's really something out here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait. I will put it up. I'll probably edit out a couple curse words every now and then, but it's not gonna be nothing big time. Yeah, like, um, yeah, on my my end, ain't no curse words gonna be edited out. I'm gonna let you know that right now. Yeah, it's gonna be TV. Wrong, it's gonna be TV 14 in this piece. TV 14, not bad. Yep. All right. All right, so we're gonna start off the first. We're gonna start off the first Grand Prix, and I want you guys to know, y'all probably can see like little bits and pieces of these, these like a lot of the cutscene, a lot of, like these. I'm gonna let this loading screen show because I'm explaining it. But a lot of the loading screens and shit are gonna be edited out because mm -hmm. it, it takes too much time. And honestly, I want to have 15 minute video that's not 30. So. I'm gonna do what I can, and I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add some more funny ass edits for you guys. Y'all already know how I do things, so we're gonna figure. Boy, it out. if you don't get your that shit is the first of all, first I of never, all, I, I, that never failed. <laughs> that edit never Woof. failed. Hey man, have you seen my car, bro? I was looking at it. That's it, please. Amy zoomed like she oh. gone out this piece, bro. Yeah. Damn, okay, I'm sorry. I didn't mean I didn't know you was that serious to get past me. Oh, by the way, uh the other day me and Enten were talking about the new Sonic movie that's currently being in being redesigned and redeveloped. All because of fan reaction and people just thinking about the about the design of Sonic, which I don't blame the them because nigga, that, that that, that because nigga, that's not even Sonic, bro. Bro, that's not even Sonic. That's San that's Sonic. If you think about it. That's Sonic. Hold on. No, I'm gonna put I'm, I'm gonna put this up on screen for you guys and edit you guys to see it on screen. Oh, it's dang it. it. Yeah. yeah uh, if you wanted to. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey, man. This is this is. It ain't sweet out here like that, bro. We ain't doing. Dang! Someone just crashed into the into the wheels. Oh, that's a bomb! I forgot. This is easy. <laughs> that nigga got his own item. <laughs> All right, Zavik, that, that's how you feel. <laughs> like y'all saw that shit. This nigga put right into me. <laughs> Ghost star. What the fuck? What's wrong? So yeah, you guys. This time uh, I have the voices in Japanese as well as uh, Seth Rap Black Zack over here. My brother got the voices in Japanese. I don't know why. It's like. Nah, you just well, did it because I did. I did it. No, honestly, I actually have been listening to a lot. I actually been paying attention to Sonic and Japanese in general. Mm -hmm. uh, like I advise you to go watch Sonic X in Japanese. The Japanese dub is actually fire. Um, they did a great job. They did a better job, honestly, than the English dub. And I grew up watching the English dub. But the, we all uh, grew, we all grew up watching the English dub. Exactly, but the Japanese dub assigned. Hey, Edition Knuckles, stay back. Has, actually has a amazing has a, has a better. It actually takes it's a better take on certain characters like uh uh like Shadow. Shadow Shed. is very, Shadow's very confused in the Japanese, in the Japanese version. He doesn't even know who the fuck he is. He's just trying to find his purpose. Like, English Dove Shadow is just an edgy ass nigga raise a kid. Damn straight. 
Damn but straight. This, but this shadow in the Japanese dub, that nigga didn't even know who he was. He just did what he had to do to figure out who he was. So he was listening to Eggman, he was listening to Rouge, he was listening to everybody. That, but that was at the time when uh, he lost his memory. Well, there was one. That was one. That was one half. The other half is when before he lost his memory, he actually teamed up with Eggman to get revenge on the human race. Right. But but the whole thing I'm saying is that the uh, the the Japanese Lord Shadow is a lot deeper and confu and more confused mm -hmm. and more like conflicted Shadow than just. Shadow's just like, I want to fight for real. <laughs> I, was like, I, wish I, could give, I wish I could give, I wish I could give you guys like a clip of that without getting copywritten. I'm pretty sure four oh, kid. I'm pretty sure four yeah. kids. Wait, is four kids even still existing right now? Nah. That's what yeah, I thought. No. So who owns, so who owns all those shows? Unless it's Funimation. Who owned those shows? That four kids used to air, and on channel fifty. Who? I don't know, I don't know honestly. Hmm. That's actually a good question. Well, I'll let y'all know is that that clip of Show Santeria is definitely going on a video. Now, granted, it might not be from Sonic X, but it's definitely gonna be from a goddamn game. It's gonna be somewhere. I'm gonna look. <laughs> That man built that PC from scratch, from down up. Goddamn right, and I gotta get a new goddamn graphics card for it. So I definitely gotta put some money in that shit. Sword and Shield is dropping next month. I can't afford to not have a good running computer. Wait, so when is the, the, the Tokyo games coming out? Uh, actually in November, actually in November as well, the fifth. Hmm. Interesting. That's, 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 my, that's the day after my mom's birthday, so. Ah, uh, uh, okay. I, 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 I'm probably not gonna be able to stream it, but I'm damn sure gonna upload some videos. Uh, now, uh, probably the content mm. and upload it a couple days after. Just for you guys, you know, my family is 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 important. Priority. It's priority, so you already know. And then I will put my content out for y'all, and I'm still going to be on my YouTube channel, that's right. Right. I'm trying to get better at but you know. I need internet instead of using this dang old hotspot of mine. But that's the only source of internet I can I can use for the time being. Let me talk about it before. This is Twenty dollars a month for for a year is that bad? Is that is that for um? You said that's for Netflix. I mean not Netflix. Uh, no. uh Xfinity. Yeah, Xfinity. Wait, do you guys have? Wait, do you guys have Netflix? We have Netflix, but we we use Xfinity for our internet. Okay. Um. That's the only reason I watch Cannon Buster. Have you? Have you watched an anime called Baki? I heard of it. It's a underground martial art. It's basically an underground martial arts anime, which I've seen the trailer, and man, it looks pretty bad. I'm the other thing. I've been wa I've been watching a lot of anime the past couple weeks, and right now, Doctor Stone is. My it's literally in my top in my top three. Not um, bad, not bad. Um, that Demon Slayer and Fire Force are mm, nope. Cannon Busters number three. Cannon Busters is is Demon Slayer. It's uh Dark Stone and Cannon Busters Demon Slayer. Honestly, the only reason I put Demon Slayer as number three is because the way they ended off the way they ended off the season is. It was confusing. Uh -oh. Yeah, Cannon Busters. They ended off their season with uh, with them going on a whole new journey. It's just so good to do it that way. Uh, Doctor Stone. That's just a dope ass anime. And honestly, the main character, even though he's white, even though he's actually Asian, his he talk like he talk like a nigga from the 
out. <laughs> That's my boy. <laughs> Speaking of anime, I need to get back on watching uh, Cowboy Bebop and Bleach. You keep going back and watching the like anime. Like, I commend you on watching Bleach. I I I I finished it and I dog I can't watch it again. <laughs> anime. Anime, bro. I, I don't know how I did it the first time. I tried to rewatch it a couple weeks ago, and I was like, bro, I'm about to fall asleep. <laughs> so, <laughs> what were you, so what were you about to say about uh, Cowboy Bebop? Cowboy Bebop, that is an anime that did not get, get enough credit. That's, that's what I said. But some dude on Facebook said that uh, it was not, it was not uh, underrated. It, I mean, not not underrated, but um, damn, damn, what do you say? He said that it wasn't underrated; it was actually overrated. And I was like, if it was overrated, if it was overrated, it would have had more episodes. It'd be talked about more. Nobody talks about that anime at all. It's a good anime for somebody who for anime that nobody talks about. I just wish they revived they that anime. They don't talk about Samurai Shampoo enough either. That shit pisses me off. Right. They don't talk that about uh, Fist of the North Star, even though, even no, though the game. That, 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 that guy gets a lot more credit than you think. I mean, yeah. I mean, well, yeah. But at the same time, I, I wish they would at least make a movie or something like that in HD. That's true. Well, I mean, they're not gonna get the Dragon Ball Super treatment, but they just update the the anime the animation of it. I. And even One Piece, One Piece got the uh, the Dragon Ball Super Broly treatment with how they how they budgeted that movie. The new right. uh, One Piece movie Stampede, mm -hmm. that, that budget for that movie was just as good. And I'm like, damn, Funimation is uh, all these niggas at these goddamn companies decided, oh, we're gonna just drop all my goddamn money on this movie. <laughs> and then, then I thought about it. Oh, Why not drop money on your two biggest selling enemies? Yes, I said Dragon Ball and One Piece is Shonen's biggest selling anime. Yep. If you don't believe it. If you don't believe it, you're high. Trust me. People, <laughs> I bet you people will say, well, Baruto is one too. Man, that shit is weird. <laughs> Nah, the, fir the, first time, the first time, the first time, the first time I heard about, yeah, Naruto, yeah, Bar the first time I heard uh, Baruto, I was like, nope, I ain't watching that. I don't care what people say. Baruto yep. was Baruto. People were talking about Baruto got good in the first after a week, after like a good five arcs of the anime being trash. I didn't want to. I didn't want to watch what the. I didn't want to watch Baruto because it didn't interest pique my interest. Are you kidding me? Yeah, it would like him, dude. Are we serious right now? No, someone, yeah. no, someone put that uh, what you call it? That that rock uh, drug. Uh, you know the you ones know that. What? Yeah, I know what you're talking about, but you know what's crazy is that I would watch two episodes of Baruto, and I actually watched them two is like ten. I was like, bro, this shit is garbage. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad um, someone, I'm glad someone else understands my pain. The, uh, I watch, I watch Bardo. Um, honestly, people say that uh, the reason why Bleach, Naruto, and One Piece are all in the big three, technically in the big three, is because, is because they're the most popular. No. They were the most popular because Dragon Ball Z ended. If Dragon Ball Z ended, that shit would have kicked, would have kicked, literally, would literally kick out of the big three. Because mm -hmm. Dragon Ball Z was making more numbers than Bleach ever could have. Of course, that's... Dragon Ball Super made more numbers than Bleach <laughs> ever would have. That's the reason Bleach got fucking canceled. <laughs> that reason Blue's got canceled. They got canceled after fighting after Blue, after Ichigo fought Isaac. Yeah, I remember. I remember that. 
Uh, yeah, that was the corniest way to go out like that. Yeah, that was it. Yeah, look, if you want to talk about assholes, asshole and transformations and all that bullshit, each of those is a prime example of that bullshit. You can't tell me that that man has not gotten some random ass ability that I, from training in his goddamn head. Mm -mm. Come on, dog. Naruto did that one time, and that was cool. Naruto, now, people are gonna hate me for saying this, Naruto and his tail, and his tail beast chalk mode is, is a definition, is a weird, is, is such a asshole like ability to me. <laughs> I agree yeah, with that. I said it, because it's corny to me, because that's, it, it's asshole to me, because how is it that the Nine Tails is the only one that has a chakra mode like that? Oh, but it's the most powerful. I mean, the Nine Tails is the It is the most powerful, but the Ten Tails is right there, and it has its own form. Eight Tails is the second most powerful. It's actually, it just is on a slightly less powerful than the Nine Tails. Yeah. Move. When Killer B transforms, when Killer B transforms, it's not, it's nothing, nothing significant. They want Nara to be to be so different that they created, they gave him a whole new form. Right. They gave him a whole new transformation. Dude, that's stupid. And then the worst part is, they they upgraded to Tail Beast, Tail Beast Chakra mode. A Tail Beast mode, pretty much. And it's like, it's the same shit Wait, with, with, with Coco. <laughs> like, you know what? <laughs> yeah, oh, I'm just gonna turn this off. There's somebody in the comment section is gonna say, But you like Dragon Ball Super. What about Ultra Instinct? I know that shit is bullshit. <laughs> I thought Ultra Instinct was lit, but hey. No, no, no. When you first watch it, yeah, it's dope. But if you go back and rewatch that, and when Goku achieved it, it was kind of. Like low key, it was kind of dumb. Let's think about it. He gets hit with the spirit bomb, doesn't die. He Man, absor he doesn't die. He absorbs. He absorbs the power of of the spirit bomb. The spirit bomb. And then to come to the whole new form, we said, "Oh, so the shell," and got ultra instinct. What the? Who the? Hey man, put the who put the music on? Uh, Wait yeah, a minute. Have you know? Have you noticed something weird about the mummies? No. They look like a kidnas. Uh, Think about it. They look like a kidnas. I, I get the reference. That's because all the kidnas died. All the ancient kidnas died. All oh, <laughs> dogs go. <laughs> all dogs go to heaven. Hey man, yeah. hey man, you ain't finna, you ain't finna be taking my spot like that, bro. I don't know. Oh, come on! No, I'm just going, you know, a little bit lag going, you know, I'm just going back there. What's uh, time I'm going to keep, keep my little lag back there. I'm, I'm coming back. <laughs> but no, uh, um, what was uh, you know I'm going to use Sonic Adventure 2. Nah, oh yeah, go ahead. <laughs> oh no. Oh, go ahead. I gotta, I'm trying to think of which ones I want to use, though. Uh, I want to use Wild Canyon. I don't use Wild Canyon that much. I mean, I that, it does Canyon. make it does make a lot of sense if you think about it. Yeah, I don't use Wild Canyon. Anymore. I love that song. You know, Could you? My favorite, my two favorites at this point: a Death Chamber mm -hmm. and uh, Wild Canyon. My two like, favorite. I love, I, I love Aquatic Mind, but it hit it. Death, Death Chamber, but that bridge hit. I don't know why, but that that vibe is crazy. That shit's crazy. What the? What are you gonna say? What are you gonna say? You're too bad for? Uh oh yeah. W would you imagine if Knuckles said, "We was kings once." Oh my god. No. <laughs> 
<laughs> He's like, yeah, that, that, that's not. That's not. That's not. That's, that's not. not. That's not. <laughs> we was kings once. We once ruled the earth. We were kings. I ain't that meme so fucking much. <laughs> Oh, did you see that meme I posted on Facebook about Knuckles becoming the, uh, you know what? Oh, no. I'm gonna actually read that. She said that I need to, uh, you guys are gonna see the meme. I'm gonna actually put it up on, on the, uh, on, on the, uh, video for you guys. Go so, ten. And then there was one where I made when 6 9 talk about Shadow doing drive-bys in Westopolis. That was me. That was me. <laughs> Oh my god. But what are the two tracks you said were the best out of your favorite out of uh, uh Science Adventure 2? Oh yeah, um a ghost pumpkin soup and the aquatic oh, mine. Pumpkin Hill and Aquatic Mine, that's true. You know what you know I didn't see a lot of people say Pumpkin Hill. That's actually a, that's actually that's actually very common. Have you played Shadow the Hedgehog? Yes. Do you remember that one mission where, um, okay, do you remember that one mission where Shadow had to go to a Halloween, uh, stage, and with Cream the Rabbit, or, uh, with Amy? Yeah, I remember. Doesn't that place look like, uh, Pumpkin Hill? Yeah, yep. You know crazy, we were talking so much, I wasn't even, I didn't even get to do that you want. Have you noticed that the stage from Shadow the Hedgehog looks exactly like, well, similar to the stage to um, Pumpkin Hill from Sonic Adventure 2? Yeah, I mean, I figured because Pumpkin Hill really wasn't used that much. Right. So, if only they could have, you know, used a Ghost Pumpkin Soup instead. They should have remixed it, honestly. Yeah, they should have remixed it. Brought back, um, the homie Hunted P, and just remixed the whole song, and everything's all good. True, but you know how, you know how the Sonic, the Sonic team, they don't do the shit. They don't think like that. <laughs> they, they don't think, they don't think the music, on the music level, they should be, because, honestly, the, to me, some of their greatest tracks was on Sonic. Well, no, yeah, Sonic Adventure, uh, Sonic Adventure 2, and Sonic Heroes. So right. We can say what we want about Sonic Heroes. We can say that Sonic Heroes had a laggy, it was a laggy ass game. And yes, it was. It, had it was. Some lag -ish. But it had I, some issues. I still but, liked it. But it's still the goat. God damn it. <laughs> and we can say, that game. I mean, come on, you. Like, we, like we can you talk about it. you can't you can't deny that Shadow the Hedgehog has good has some good soundtracks. Like remember yeah. remember the um Heavy Dog theme song. Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah, the no 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 it wasn't Heavy Dog it was a uh, Blue Falcon Blue Falcon that was the one. Yeah Blue yeah Blue Falcon that's the one. I was uh, like ooh that Killer Nightclub track. Sonic Riders had a an underrated OST. <laughs> Very under si very yeah, very cyberpunk like. Mm, they did really good with that one. Zero gravity, oh. man. Zero gravity. Man. That was Zero the gravi That was that was legit. I love that game so much. Um fucking three riders doing the goddamn series. Like I think through traffic, that was one of my favorite OSTs of all time. Um, so, uh, you want to talk about Sonic Free Riders? No. <laughs> no. I, 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 my childhood was ruined because of that shit. <laughs> cause they, cause they only wanted it on Xbox. No, they only wanted, they wanted it on that Xbox Connect, that piece of shit. Yeah, that's what I mean. It was only, only on Xbox. Even though, yeah, it was on Xbox. <laughs> like you disgrace, you have disgraced me. Oh, and you cannot. Part is, oh, you know oh go ahead. Is that Sonic Free Riders had one of the best character rosters in that entire uh, Sonic series. 
And yet yeah, them. Game. Now, I never really got a chance to listen to the music. I never paid attention to it either. Um, you know, I would love a Sonic Heroes. Yeah, and before people say this is Sonic Heroes, too, fuck y'all, this ain't it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, which one was Sonic Heroes? Two? Oh, you talking about Team Sonic Racing? Yeah. Nah. Hey, yeah, this ain't this ain't this ain't it, Chief. It really ain't. Team uh, Team Sonic Racing has is this the Mario Kart with Sonic Heroes quality, but it's hey, not, it ain't the same. But I rolled off. Uh, damn it, I rolled off. Man. All right, <laughs> I'm man, I'm at eleven. Man. You know what? <laughs> yo, 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 is that? Team, you know what, Sonic Heroes, Sonic Hero 2, with all the characters that Sega has now, Sonic Heroes 2 would be literally god. I am in last place. Damn. You Man. said you stink Eggman. You literally said you stink Eggman. Did you come in first? Nah, I came in third. But yeah, Sonic Heroes 2. I remember what I remember reading a Disney uh, kids Disney magazine sta stating that is there gonna be a Sonic Hero possible Sonic Heroes 2 g game coming out? Ain't heard nothing. Ain't heard nothing about it. I waited and waited. I bought the other Sonic games, but at the same time, ain't nothing happened. I'm gonna be honest with you. You so goddamn loyal to the Sonic series. Wait, what? It's, you so loyal to the Sonic series. It's almost surprise. It's really surprising. Because I mean, hey, if it wasn't if it wasn't for my cousin, who's into the Sonic series, I wouldn't be into the Sonic se series. So I gotta give him credit for that. So, I'm honest with you. Sonic Adventure 2 is still still has. Have the best OST out there. Oh, no doubt about it. Sonic Adventure 2, best OST, best gameplay, best story. That's why that game got a 10 out of 10. It really got a 10 out of 10? Yeah, but yeah, I mean, ain't, ain't it the most successful uh, game game of all time? I'm pretty sure. Well, you know, the gameplay mechanics had its flaws. But it wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't terrible. It got a nine out of ten. So it oh, it did. Um, the my bad, ladies and gentlemen. You know what? I'm not gonna edit in the actual the actual rating, but I definitely can tell you, Steam rated it as nine out of ten. GameStop, GameStop, are rated it as four point out of five. That's crazy. Oof, man, that saxophone gives out a straight up good vibe, man. Shout outs to June, shout outs to June Sano and to Hoyo Hatami, to Hoyo Hatami. I, I, I want you to know there's like people all telling me about Mario having better I'm sorry, but I, I, I can't let that I cannot let that slide, bro. The only the only oh well, actually the only song that I like from Mario Kart 8 was the one with the Dragon's Palace. That was a pretty good song. Odyssey Mario Mario Odyssey has some of the best OSC. Has some of the best Mario OSC. Oh no doubt about it. Especially when you go to New York and you get that jazzy that old school ja jazzy feel to it. Oh, New Donk City. City. Where you see guys walking around with hats thinking it's 1922. Oh, come on. Mario walking around looking like he was in the mafia. That's true. I'd rather have I'd rather have Mario wear a mafia suit than his plumber outfit. That's that's actually facts, facts. But you know what's crazy is that there will like Odyssey. Odyssey, as much as I love Odyssey, 
nothing as far as nothing as far as like the purposes wise. Jesus Christ. Network error has occurred. Oh come okay. on. Bro. That's right, messed up. Unfortunately right, the net the network has interrupted our gameplay and I was in second place, this man was in first place. Oh god. I'm hurt. But we'll be back. We'll we'll come back after we get into the lobby. I'm Samurai Blazek. And Anthony Cote here. And we'll be right back. We are signing out. Peace. Peace. Okay, so, oh, I